Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel, JT Open Stuff. And you might be thinking to yourself right now, JT, don't you typically open toys? Little minis, like maybe these, I don't know, like these little mini Dole Bananas, or I don't know, maybe like these little Create Gardens, just things like that. Don't you open up toys? Why do you have Yankee Candle on the opening table? I mean, you've done weird things before. You've opened up Crocs and different things like that. Well, guys, there's a reason that this Yankee Candle bag is on the opening table today. And it is probably one of the most unexpected things that I've had happen to me in a very, very long time. Last weekend, I went with my wife and my daughter to the mall. And we were just kind of looking around. And my daughter wanted to stop in Yankee Candle. They started... With their fall scents, they had a lot of, you know, pumpkin smells, you know, just different things like that. But there was one table that had more Halloween-themed items. There were taper candles that when you light them, looked like they would bleed down the candle. There were little, I don't know, just all kind of like little, you know, um, foggy night and all these different things. And then I look over and I say, I, I thought to myself, like, you know, that one looks interesting. And I'd been smelling pretty much all the candles. I don't know if you guys do that, but every time I go to Yankee Candle with my wife or my daughter, I smell pretty much every candle. I'm kind of amazed at how close some of them are and how far off others are, but I always smell everything. And so I picked this guy up. Now, the thing that comes, his description, some of you may or may not even care about this, but for those of you that are going to get this, you're going to think to yourselves that it is just as insane as me. I'm pretty sure of it. So I picked up this Witch's Brew candle. Really cool little design there, as you can see. So if you just had this sitting kind of on your counter, just like that, cool candle, you know, you're getting a little bit of skull, some flowers, but you think to yourself, what does witch's brew smell like? So here, let's take a smell. You guys smell that? That smells like something that we know from somewhere, but where have I smelled this smell before? Guys, it literally took me about two seconds to figure out where this witch's brew scent kind of resides in my brain. Why did I have this scent in my brain? And well, it's this guy right here. This guy right here is Masters of the Universe Stinkor. Now, Stinkor was one of my absolutely favorite Masters of the Universe figures growing up. And when you popped open that first that first time you popped open your Stinkor figure, he was scented to smell like a skunk, is what they said. Now, I think it smelled a little bit better than a skunk, but that scent has just been with me my entire life. Every time I smell something that's kind of like that, it goes right back to those Stinkor figures. Guys, I'm telling you right now, this Witch's Brew Yankee Candle scent is 100% the same scent as Stinkor. Now, you may not be into Masters of the Universe. Who knows, you may be. But this scent, if you've ever smelled a Stinkor figure in your entire life, I would ask you, in fact, I would implore you, I would beg you, go down to Yankee Candle. Even if you don't buy this Witch's Brew Candle, do me a favor, take the lid off of it and give it a smell. That, to me, is as close as I'm ever going to get to that childhood experience of opening my first Stinkor Masters of the Universe figure. So this guy right here, this, this candle, is going to go in my opening room, and I'm going to light it, and I'm going to get that scent of Stinkor all in my room, and I'm going to enjoy the heck out of it. Now, kind of made me start thinking, are there other Yankee Candle scents that might remind people of other things. You know, my wife was a huge fan of strawberry shortcake growing up. Are there candles in Yankee Candle 
that would remind her of strawberry shortcake? I don't know. It's possible. But what are some of you guys' favorite kind of fall Halloween scents that are out there right now? Hopefully, it's Witch's Brew. And if it's not, hopefully this video will get you down to your local Yankee Candle and get a whiff of this. If you want to know what a, say, 10-year-old JT was smelling when he opened up his first Thinkor figure, this is it, guys. So I really hope you enjoyed today's video. I know it's something different. It's kind of silly to most of you, I'm sure. But there are times in our lives where we just have that song or that scent or that place that just immediately takes us back to something in our childhood. And this absolutely did it for me. So thank you, Yankee Candle, for doing that because whether intentional or not, you took me right back to being a kid and enjoying the heck out of, out of life and toys. So thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I really do appreciate it. And hey, leave a comment in the comments down below and let me know. Have you gone to take a scent of this or a whiff of this? What do you think? Which of the new fall candles is your favorite? Let me know in the comments down below. I've got a lot of great toy opening videos coming up, guys. So I hope you join me for those. I'll see you when those videos publish. And thank you so much for watching. Bye.